some of our subcontractors, subtrade suppliers are still unclear with the process, and they are pending on GCs, general contractors, for instructions. Uh, but at the same time, the whole industry is evolving and improving, and there are new technologies out there that the whole community is still learning. So, uh, subcontractors waiting for directions. At, at the same time, GCs are still learning, and it, it's just a community that needs to continue to grow together. Watching that we get from products, consumer products mostly, and I see that suppliers are saying, "Oh yes, I will comply to your lead standard." And we see equipment at the end with all the uh, with the MSDS sheets and how the efficiency is. It's not. It's it's the whole system that will work. Then that particular product will be efficient. And sometimes it's just uh, it's greenwashing to us when we just say oh, when the supplier just say, "Oh yes, we are green." For lead, it's all about documentation. It's getting the information for everything in your project. So therefore, uh, you need someone that collects all the information and gather it and put it at the right categories. And that just takes time. And and for that person to uh, verify if those documents that we collect from the subtrace from suppliers are good information. That is, we just need a, a professional to, uh, or a, a accredited professional to uh, review the, the information. The BC Building Code 2013, it's above what LEED required. LEED is only uh, for uh, 2007 standards. So, so if we were to comply to just our building codes, it is already a green standard. Uh, green building so it is beyond lead now and I think uh, it is a good thing it's just we're pro uh, building more green developments there are owners that do not want to pursue for lead but they they embrace lead uh, sorry green uh, development green construction so uh, for example in city of Vancouver to comply with the code in the city, it is already above uh, a lot of municipality, other municipalities are codes. So within the city of Vancouver, you whatever you build is already a green construction.